everybody, it's the Assassin. I'm here with fucking Baby Vlogs on his new R1 that is a piece of shit. <laughs> Fuck you. <laughs> it's not a piece of shit, but it is having problems. But yeah, we're just going on a little joyride. Got my R1, he's got his R1. Hopefully it doesn't break down. Fingers are fucking across. For real. It's so disappointing. This bike is so beautiful, I wanted it so fucking bad, but she might go back to the dealership. I mean, you had quite a bit of options there, so. Yeah, I know. Just do not get a European bike, please. No, if I, if I get anything, I, I'm getting a fucking ZX-10. I don't ride a lot of bikes, but if I do, it's going to be either Cowie or Yamaha. Yeah. Not saying anything bad about Yamaha, because this bike, I'm sure if they could figure out what was wrong with it, it would be fucking pristine, but I don't know. This one's just having issues, and I'm really upset about it. Yeah. Because let's real quick, before this light turns red or green, look at this fucking bike dude it is so beautiful it's lower too and yeah and i can touch the ground in this fucking thing <laughs> but i don't know i'm not i, don't know, I need a bike that works because i ride like an adult we need a light that's gonna fucking turn green, green too we should be next what i said did that I was I wasn't fucking blipping the throttle I wasn't letting out the clutch weird you probably weren't giving it enough sauce probably yeah. <laughs> Dude, it smells like it's on fire again. Yeah, that's another thing about your bike. That's, yeah, I don't know. That's fucking weird. So, I took the bike back to the dealership and they were like, Oh, it sounds like a fuel issue and we'll do this and we'll do that. And if we can't get it done, we'll send it off to a third party. And I was like, alright, I don't care. Do what you guys gotta do. Get my bike running. As long as I ain't gotta pay for it. Yeah, I'm not paying for it. But, uh... So they called, they told me that they were gonna, I called them and they are like, okay, we'll throw a fuel pump in it. And um, you know, cause they said they couldn't duplicate the issue that was going wrong with my bike. And I was like, well, it ain't that hard. You just gotta ride it and get on it a couple times. And then it will eventually just bog down when you go to throttle. You know, didn't, they, didn't you say they told you that they fucking got it up to 160 and it was fine? Yeah, that's what they said, and I was like, well, I feel like they lied to you about that, because I don't know if dealerships, because I know, like, mechanics and shit can get in trouble if they, like, romp on people's cars. Yeah. And vehicles and, I, and shit. I know that, but I specifically told them, I was like, by any means, do what you guys do need to do. Like, romp on it, I don't care, because once it comes back to my hands, the bike will go through hell. So I literally told them, I was like, just do what you guys need to do, get my bike running do what you guys need to do get my bike running good yeah and so i left them alone for a few days i called them back and i was like so did you guys get the fuel filter in or the fuel pump in and they're like uh no we didn't put one in because the fuel pump looked fine and i was like well okay i guess and then they said they 
they sent it off to a third party. The third party told me that they took my fuel system out, cleaned my fuel system, cleaned my injectors, you know, the works, and I was like, okay. And I was like, well, I'm gonna ride it before I load it up and take it home. So I rode it and it was doing fine for a little while and then it started bogging at about 9,000 RPMs. And I was like, well, what in the hell? I was like, you guys said you fixed it. <laughs> and I was like, ride it, dude, tell me. He, he rode it. I literally watched him take off on my bike. I heard him get on it. Yeah, I was cruising at like fucking 40 miles an hour in first gear. I'll, I'll throw up the clip right now. Oh God, it's doing it, yep. It just did it. Yep. It's, yeah, it's off. That's fucking crazy, bro. It shut off. Of me riding it and it just died on me. Yeah, so he rode it and he said he got it to 12.5 RPM and it didn't bog. And I was like, well, whatever. I'll just take it home. And I was like, I'll get it on camera and then I'll bring it back. So that's what we're here to do. But I don't want to keep taking this bike an hour and a half away for them to maybe fix my bike and I'm, I just, I'll take a different one, I don't care. I just want a sport bike and I want a 1000. It fucking sucks too bro, cause that bike is minty for an 09. And it is beautiful, absolutely beautiful. New fucking everything is on it bro. Yeah. Full two brother system exhaust, you know. What more could you ask for? Fucking new levers, like expensive ass levers too. Oh yeah, I got the expensive ABS levers that fold in so like if the bike does happen to go down, the levers aren't gonna break. But, God dude, this thing smells like it's on fire. I really wanna know why it does that. Me too. I wanna know why this bike doesn't work that well. <laughs> <laughs> Let's take these access roads and fucking get it. Let's do it. Dude, I got some poppy poppy out of that one. I'm not throwing a check engine light. I'm not throwing any codes. Yes, my check engine light is plugged in. I, I just don't understand what is going wrong. And nobody else will ride it hard enough for them to be able to tell me what is going wrong with my bike. These bikes do sound beautiful in harmony though. Oh yeah. Fucking 
ECU thing that someone must have done or the dealership must have done or something. I think maybe the person that had this bike before did fuck with some shit. Yeah. She keeps staring. God, just look at it. Just look at it. Let me get a, a thumbnail for the she fucking is video. So beautiful. You got the two brothers exhaust. Look at these levers. Look at the levers, all oh, they're amazing. <laughs> yeah, guys, I don't know. We'll see. I'll write it back home so I can get my point of view on it. Yeah. Have you even tried to wheelie it yet? No, <laughs> no. I'll wheelie yours at some point. Well, you're riding it back home, so. Well, at least I get to keep your shit, Boggs. <laughs> oh, what's up, guy? Hopefully that's not the same one that went and tried to fucking chase me down the other day. Someone tried to chase you on his bike? Yeah. On my bike? <laughs> yeah. Someone tried to chase you down? Yeah, it was a sheriff. <laughs> oh, was that a sheriff we just passed? Yeah. Oh, shit. So, like, I was on Rick Williamson. Uh-huh. Like, pretty close to Ranger Highway, the, the road that I live on. And I was just, like, cruising. I was like, I don't know if I was speeding, which I'm pretty sure I was. It's a 1,000. You're always speeding. But I was watching him in the, in the mirror, and he, he flipped a bitch, and I was like, and I literally was like about to turn. So as soon as I turned, I was like, not today, sir. <laughs> and I just pinned and I was doing like 174 There's another down one that, right there. Yeah, I was doing like 174 down that road and pulled into my neighborhood. And uh, I was like waiting for him because I knew he was coming. And I parked the bike in my driveway and then he like pulled into my neighborhood and was trying to be sneaky and turned his lights off. And I was like, yeah, no sir, not today. You ain't getting on me today. <laughs> well, I gotta show you the videos, dude. I was on a 110 pit bike. I rode a 110 pit bike from Weatherford to Mineral Wells the other day. Are you fucking serious? Yeah, all back road. It's, 
literally dying right now. It's really? trying to die. Just pull your clutch and it goes. No. You can do it. I believe in you. Where are you at? I'm coming. I'm fucking putt putting along. Your bike fucking sucks. Shut up. I thought my bike sucked. This one is even worse. Hey, shut up. She's pretty. That's all that matters. <laughs> Did you really? Yeah. <laughs> that that came up a lot easier than I thought it would. Dude, the brakes on that bitch are good. All right, guys. I don't know, dude. We'll see. But I guess we'll end the video here. Not too bad for the first dual vlogs with the assassin. Hey, don't do that. Piece of shit. They'll be like, oh, why is there punches and kicks thrown at it? <laughs> That'd be a good thumbnail, just fucking <laughs> kicking that bitch over. <laughs> but I don't know. I guess we'll end the vlog here. We'll see w whether I'm back on the R1 or maybe a ZX10. Who knows? Dude, get a ZX10. We'll fuck it up together. Yeah, I just won't have a cross plane motor. But I'll be faster than you. you probably will be. <laughs> All right, we'll see you guys, baby vlogs. Peace out. Sassin' out. out.